Uh, hello, uh, this is Crimson Gaming. Today I'm going to show you how to create your own Minecraft server. It's really simple. All you've got to download is like two things and then go through some files. So, right, the first thing you want to do is go to the link I've given you in the description, which is going to open up uh, this here. You want to click download, and uh, once you've downloaded everything, you want to open up a matchy. Uh, you want to click network, create a new network. Put in your network ID, you put whatever you want in here. This is just the name of your network. You can put a password in if you want one. Right, I've got one here. Uh, Jim is mid92, very original. Right, you want to take note that this is your IP address right here. And you're going to need this to uh, put settings into your server and to log on to Minecraft later on. So, right, we're going to just minimize this for, this for the moment. Uh, the second thing you want to do is go to the Minecraft website and um, Click on download here, you can see. Uh, you want to uh, scroll down to the multiplayer beta server software. Uh, click this here uh, down, uh, to download it. So you want to uh, you want to click this here to download the Minecraft server.exe. Uh, you want to make a file, which I've made one here on my desktop to put it in. So once you've downloaded it and everything's sorted, you want to gonna yeah, you're gonna want to run it. Uh, and once you run it, it says it's going to be uh, preparing a level. Uh, but you don't really need to do that yet. See, it's created more f uh, files here in this folder that you saved it into. What you're going to want to do is open up this here with Notepad, which is called Server. And this is the settings for your server. Uh, I'm just going to copy some over from my cr my server that I'm using at the moment. Uh, show you what you, what I have. Uh, I don't know what you mean. You can put whatever you want in. So this right, this bit right here is going to be the name of your world. You call it uh, Awesome World of Awesomeness if you wanted to. Uh, this here determines if it's a hell world or not. It's got that on false. This here allows you to teleport to the Nether. I've got that on a uh, few distance. If you want to spawn monsters or not. Online mode. This is important. You want to have that as false. Uh, spawn animals, whatever, maximum players, server IP. And this is where you need to match it. You want to go and uh, get this number here and type that into here so that you, that's your IP address in the servers. Uh, PVP, level, I've just got that blank level seed. Uh, server port, just leave that how it, uh, how it comes. Allow flight, if you want to be able to fly, go for it. And then whitelist, I've got on false. Now you're going to want to uh, save that and then close it. So you've got your matchy, you've got your network sorted out, you've got your IP address here, and you've got your server. So what you're going to want to do is run your server, and then this window here is going to pop up, and it's going to say that it's spawning server uh, and creating world, that kind of stuff. I mean, it takes a minute or something. So then you want to go and run Minecraft. Uh, when it finally wants to uh, load up, you know. So here we go. Log in. Just uh, oh, I'll move down. Whatever. Alright, click on multiplayer. You want to put your IP address in here. The one that's on Hamachi. This here you want to put in here. You want to connect, and then that's it. You've got your own world. I mean, you can do whatever you want. So, right, that's your server done. But if you want to, like, restart your server or anything, this is the folder here that's created. That's, that would be the awesome world shit. <laughs> but if you want to make a new server, all you do is just open that up, change the name there, and then it would make a new a new folder in here. So that, means, that means you've got your old one. And then you've got your new one that's currently in the server. So that's basically all you've got to do. If you've got any questions, don't hesitate to comment. If you would really appreciate it if you like and favorite the video. Um, I'll catch you next time.